Now, San Diego's most accurate forecast, 10 News Pinpoint Weather, sponsored by Mission Federal Credit Union. Well, we have a live shot of the downtown area up inside our newsroom. I guess it's just behind us. So the clouds you can see kind of persisting right now. Yeah, especially along the coast. So some areas might not see full clearing. Coronado also partly cloudy at 839 in the morning. But it's another good day to get outdoors because it's not going to rain today. However, that could change here over the next couple of days. On this early Sunday morning, our current conditions all across the county. Mid 50s there in Ramona. Julian still pretty chilly at 40 degrees mid 40s and alpine along our coastline upper 50s to lower 60s. We are talking about the winds, the mountains and the deserts. That's where we are seeing the strongest winds. We could see west winds up to 30 miles per hour with isolated gusts up to 60. Our wind future cast showing that the winds are going to increase as we get into our evening and nighttime hours. Ocotillo Wells seems to be the strongest winds, 35 miles per hour by 10 o'clock tonight. Again, the winds expected to be strong until tomorrow morning along the coast and inland valleys not quite as strong but it could be breezy at times we are also talking about showers so by tuesday into wednesday that's when we could see scattered showers pretty much throughout the entire county however not expected to get a lot of precipitation out of the system maybe along the coast up to a quarter of an inch forecast highs for today 60s along the coast upper 60s in our inland valley 68 in la mesa same temperature there in el cajon our seven day forecast we are going to draw up our temperatures as we get into Tuesday, but check out this roller coaster ride. Put your hands up, Jim, because by the end of the week, we're talking about the 70s along the coast, 80s in our inland valleys, and then check out the deserts. We're going to go from the 80s down to the 70s, then near 100 by Saturday.